This is 60 Second Civics, the daily podcast of the Center for Civic Education. I'm Mark Gage. John Locke believed that through reasoning, we can determine what rights people would have in a state of nature. Locke reasoned that in a state of nature, all people seek to have the rights to life, liberty, and property. The right to life is based on the observation that people want to survive. They want to be as safe as possible from threats to their lives. The right to liberty is based on the idea that people want to be as free as possible. People want to be able to make their own decisions and to live as they please. The right to property means that people want to own the things that are necessary to survive, such as food, houses, tools, or land. People want the freedom to work and to gain economic benefits. John Locke's ideas on natural rights were used in the Declaration of Independence to explain why Americans were opposed to British rule in the colonies. After winning the Revolutionary War, the founders used most of the same ideas to write their state constitutions. The ideas of natural rights philosophy also are important to the kind of government that we have today. That's all for today's podcast, 60 Second Civics, where civic education only takes a minute.